Hello, teacher Jackie here with a quick video, I hope it's quick, it may be a little ramble, about you need to know what this is all about. I keep seeing teachers talk on the Facebook group. I've seen teachers talk on YouTube and it has frustrated me to no end that if they think before they speak, they will kind of understand things. I love that VIP kid does listen to their teachers. I love that teachers give their experiences and opinions. And this has been key, both of these, listening and, and talking and the conversation happening to evolve VIP kid to the amazing company it is. It is still young, but I think it's the longest or the best and the uh, oldest, if you will, of this type of uh, company. It's, it's industry leading, in my opinion. Okay, what am I talking about? Well, if you're a current teacher, hey, love you. If you're a prospective teacher, even more. Talk to me and I'll help you get hired. I love VIP Kid. It works for what I need it for. Number one, why do you want to work with or for VIP Kid? Most people, money and flexibility and work from home. I have pajama pants on, but I'm wearing a VIP kid shirt. So things like that. So there's all these really great reasons why this is an amazing solution for full-time or side income. But before you keep saying I work for VIP kid, this is the mindset that needs to change. This is what frustrates me about the frustrations of fellow teachers. They are valid, they are valid, they are valid about, you know, certain things about pay, about cancellations, about bookings, about all these things. They are so wonderful. But this is the number one thing everyone needs to keep in mind. You are a contracted teacher. You're a contractor. You're a vendor. You are one of many. You are not an employee. You are not, you know, getting health insurance. You're not getting benefits. You have to pay taxes. There's a 1099 coming your way at the end of the year. And, and many of us know that, but we still don't think of that when we start to post or send in a ticket or do a video. So I think it's very important, even crucial, to keep that mindset that you are a contracted worker, not employee. Don't use the word employee. Don't use I work for. VIP Kid is entrusting you to keep with their standards. You know, smile, use TPR, engage, use reward systems. This is what makes them unique. Help your chi uh, child, student, Use complete sentences. There's other companies that say, well, in conversation, you say, what's your name? I just say, Jackie. I don't say, my name is Jackie. You know, that kind of thing. But VIP Kid has their standards to set them apart. And they have these things. And they have their rules. Every contract is evolving, too. There's frustration about, well, the new contracts have this, where my contract had that. Well, my training said wear an orange shirt, so I made sure I wore an orange shirt where everyone else is like, well, the new contract says wear whatever. We can't force you to wear an orange shirt, which is true. This is my classroom. I create the environment. I create the synergy, the energy, the um, culture, whether it's, I gotta, I gotta use a prop, happy, whether it's not happy, boring. Hey, you know, can you read that sentence, please? Yeah, great. Okay, let's go to the next slide. <laughs> you get my idea. Please know before you post that you are not an employee. So be careful when you feel like you have this, you know, VIP kid needs to listen to me. Well, actually, a VIP kid can just psh, psh, toss you to the side because you're a contractor. So this is a caution, especially those who want to use this for full 
time, income, like they rely on this for their bills, you know, rent, electricity, car payments or insurance or, you know, everything. Be careful. Be careful. Yes, VIP kid. Well, listen, if you learned anything in life and, and through any job, uh, a contract job or full-time employment job, you need to have a problem with a solution, okay? Don't just come complaining. Come with ideas to have a solution. That's the best way to be heard. You know, they say the squeaky wheel gets the oil or whatever. Well, some squeaky wheels get replaced with a new wheel. So be careful. I love all my teachers that are with and trying to currently get hired on. And again, hiring, you're being contracted. So be careful with the words you're saying and with the mindset you're saying it with. You're not an employee, you're a contractor. You're not being hired, you're being contracted. Okay, so be very careful with all of that. And it may decide whether you do or don't want to come into the company. Personally, it's side income for our family. Yes, it's putting food literally on my table. Yes, it's paying for gas money in my car to get to and from the grocery store. And if they don't want to renew my contract, that's their choice, but they do have to, in my opinion, you know, back it up. But overall, I'm a contracted teacher. I am not an employee. I just think that's so key for people to keep in mind as they post and complain on the groups and as they post on YouTube. I love it. If you would like to join VIP Kid, message me. Use my code down below as my referral link. I would love to help you through the process. If you're a current teacher, chat with me. Let's get to know each other. I love chocolate. I love ice cream. I love to sew. I have cats. I have kids. <laughs> Let's connect. This is the most amazing community you could join. These people are some that travel. They teach classes, get paid, buy a ticket, travel. Teach classes, get paid, travel. Those people must not have kids. But anyway, there are workshops to improve yourself. And if you're a homeschooler, this job has job gig. I like to call it gig. This gig has helped me, improved me to be a better homeschool mom. Actually, we school at home because my kids are actually in virtual school too. <laughs> anyway, my name is Teacher Jackie. Oops, that's fine. <laughs> my name is Teacher Jackie, and I, again, just want to share information, and in this case, share the mindset of what it is to be a VIP kid teacher. Don't forget. All right, until next time. Bye-bye. Happy teaching.